I feel good, you know, especially we got the win, and uh, that's the most important part uh, for, especially for us, going into next season, uh, getting the victory, get things going. Uh, we clicked pretty good, you know, some mistakes here and there on offense, but defense played great as always, and uh, we definitely showed uh, the crowd that we still have uh, the competitive spirit uh, in the last game. It's been better if we finish this game going into the playoffs next week, you know, despite the debacle that's been going on all year long, you know, we finished up strong, got a last win for the franchise, and, you know, looking forward to next year. We feel pretty good. End the season on a high note. Uh, we worked hard all week and just said, hey, let's end the season with great pride, and that's what we came out and did. We had a chance to actually get ahead on the team this, this week, and we just turned it up, you know. When teams are able to run their offense against us, it's kind of hard to get sacks when they can, you know, throw the ball out real quick. But, you know, we got a chance to get up a couple of scores, and that's when we get to do what we do, and that's us rushing past. Oh, we did fairly well. Uh, we moved the ball when we need to. We didn't get into in too many third down and long situations, any fourth down situations that much. Uh, we moved the ball very well. Uh, play calling was great, and uh, we executed when we need to. From start to end, I mean, even though it was a couple of mistakes, and at the end of the day, we gelled. We played together. I mean, a couple of long, long passes, a couple of great runs. Offensive line did great. Receivers are amazing. RJ stuck in there, made some great throws. Well, I was proud of how you know, we fought back, and I think the whole second half, I think we did. This game set up to do. You gotta, if you're not, if you're not scoring, you give them possessions away. So, um, I was proud of the guys for fighting hard. We, you know, we kept it moving, we kept fighting. I just want to be more technically sound, be more disciplined. I had a year under my belt, so there's definitely no excuses. Um, I want to be more aware of what's going on on the field, with reading the quarterbacks and my film study and everything like that. Oh, it's tremendous. We have great fans, you know what I'm saying? They're going to be loud. Uh, especially when we make plays for them, uh, they're definitely going to cheer and uh, get rowdy, get loud, and it's definitely uh, makes the other opposing team you have to deal with that, and that, that's that's big for communication. Um, the atmosphere tonight was like it's been all year. I mean, fans came out, were loud, were into the game, so it, it was like, like it's been all year. Even though it was a down year for them, they were kind of upset, kind of sad, but they came out to their part. It was helping out a whole lot. The crowd here in Jacksonville is always good. You know, we had a rough season this year, but you know, everyone was here still supporting us. And I mean, it's good to get support despite your record. So, I mean, it was a great feeling to hear the crowd, you know, doing the things they do and enjoying the game. Uh, we're thankful to have these fans here to still support us even after having the season we had. So, I'd love to be in Jacksonville, you know, and I'll be honored to come back. I mean, the best fans in the league. I've known that since I was playing against them for two years, playing with them for two years now. I mean, um, they're great. It's, you know, we're, say we're not playing for anything, we're not going to the playoffs, but they still show up uh, like they usually do loud to get into the game. It's, got, it's tough. I've played here on the opposing team. It's tough when you're on offense and guys in the huddle can't hear what the play is. So I mean, thanks to them for sticking, for sticking with us all year. And, um, you know, it's too bad we couldn't give him a couple more games.